What is going on you guys make it Wayne back and today we've got another diamond gameplay I know I already did do a gameplay on this card, but I did not do very well with him at all So I'd like to give you guys another look at him see if we can pick up a couple of hits today But he has 89 contact versus right 93 contact versus left 58 power versus right and 67 power versus left he has 99 vision he has really good speed at 91 let's try and swipe some bags today also make sure to keep sending in those pack opening reactions the directions are in the description down below let's jump into this game getting a look at my opponent's lineup he has brandon crawford chris davis edwin Encarnacion, kyle schwarber jose bautista and cole hamels on the mound and once again, we're getting Noah Syndergaard. Let's see if we can put things together. Starting this game out with Jackie Robinson up to the plate. We are going to hit the curveball right to the third baseman. Not the start we want. One out in the inning. Reggie Stalker up to the plate. He had a huge game in the last game we did play. But let's see if we can put it together in this one as well. I do struggle against Cole Hamels for some reason. But I'm not struggling there. Getting Noah Syndergaard once again. We struggled in his last two appearances. Let's see if we can get things together and get a good quality start two outs in the inning haven't gone with any off speed yet So let's see if we can throw him off and he is going to swing and miss at that pitch So we have an 0-1 count. Let's go with the high cheese here See if we can get this one past him after going with the curveball. That's a ground ball, but easy play three outs Jim Edmonds up to the plate had a nice game last time Let's see if we can put it together in this one as well. He needs to get back on track. Get back to the Jim Edmonds in the regular game plays as that one is hit high. Very deep to the outfield. That one is back to the wall. And it's going to be a ground roll double. Runners on first and third. Diamond Jose Bautista up to the plate. He's going to get a ground ball here. That's going to be enough to score the run. We're going to take the lead. Back to the mound in this one. Now have a one run lead. Let's see if we can keep it. That ball is hit very high and very deep i might have a chance at this ball let's see if we can get it and just like that a home run i don't know what it is but it seems like his pitches have been all over the place the last couple of games i haven't been able to locate anything and we left a sinker right down the middle of the plate which does make it a tie game but we are ahead in this count oh two let's go with the high fastball see if he will chase get the first out of the inning high fastball strikeout one two count on jose bautista let's see if we can set him down with this curveball and he's chasing that pitch so i'm gonna be throwing it a lot runner on first base jackie robinson up to the plate i'm gonna see if i can throw him off with a bunt that would have been a good decision if he could have kept that fair but now we have an 0-1 count Gonna go with the contact swing here. We're on it once again, but that's gonna be a double play. Actually, yes, it is gonna be a double play. Already two outs in the inning. Brandon Crawford up to the plate. Syndergaard kind of cruising right now as he's gonna hit a lazy fly ball. And Reggie Stalker making a great catch. Looking to get some production from Jose Bautista. He has had a couple hits, but I wanna see some tanks as we are on that pitch. But that's gonna be a line drive, and he's gonna end up missing it. That has been happening a lot lately lately i have no idea why but we're on second with a stand-up double mlb the show i would appreciate if you would give me some pitches like that because those would pretty much be unhittable because that thing was moving outside the zone and then it went back in and i'm pretty sure nobody throws a change up that moves that much but we are up 0-2 in this count so you guys already know he's been chasing it the whole entire game so why not go back to it the curveball down in the zone strike three Syndergaard finally looking like the old Syndergaard these last couple of innings getting out on the regular that's what I like to see but let's see if we can continue get him deep in this game before we do have to go to the bullpen that was right down the middle I get bailed out two outs jackie robinson back up to the plate currently 0 for 2 at this point let's see if we can get something going in this at bat i really want to show you guys his speed on the basis but you can't show it off if you can't get any hits so let's see what we have here that pitch is gonna hit me let's see if we can swipe this bag with jackie robinson too easy a rod up to the plate runner on second base this is a big spot where we need to drive in a run i'm gonna steal with jackie robinson here i don't think he sees it coming he goes with a curveball way too easy swiping another one my opponent walks a rod that brings up xander bogarts he has had two ground outs in this game but that's not gonna be a ground out there that ball is way deep 
stepping up to score Jackie Robinson, taking back the lead 2-1. to one. I would love to see Jim Edmonds get another multi-hit game because he was struggling, as you guys do know, and it would be nice to get him back on a hot streak and get more hits as that's going to be a cutter for a ball. So it is a 1-1 one, one count, two outs in the inning. A-Rod on first base as he's trying to get that curveball over, and he is unable to do that. So I'm guessing fastball here. That is what he throws. That one is high, very deep, and that is a no-doubt home run, and that's why he's still in the lineup. Now we have a little bit of cushion for Noah Syndergaard with the three-run lead. If we do make a couple mistakes, but I'd still like to only hold my opponent to one run because Noah Syndergaard has been dealing in real life. Let's see if he can get a strikeout. That's exactly what he's going to do. One out. I wouldn't mind pitching with this card every single game if he pitched like this every single game. But we are going to have to try and get these last couple out. See if we can get him through this game. Maybe give him a couple more insurance runs as that's going to be strike one. But now it's time to go with the fastball in on the hands. See if we can get him to swing and miss at that as well. That is right down the middle, down the line. Let's see if we can make a play on that. Jose Bautista, make a play on it. Another home run. Robinson back up to the plate once again. Still looking for that first hit. And that is a good pitch dip, but it's hard to tell the difference between Fernando Rodney because he could bring it up at 98, and then he can drop a changeup in there at 81 miles per hour as he's throwing another one there. We are going to be early on it, so we do find ourselves down 0-2 in the count. Come on, Jackie. I need to see something from you as that's going to be ball one. Come on. Here we go. Give me a pitch to hit. Let's try and get on base once again, and that's going to be ball two. We already have been on base with him, but I'd like to get a hit. We still have not been able to do that yet, and we're getting a fastball up in the zone. I felt like I was on it, barely missing it. A-Rod back up to the plate, still looking for his first hit in this one, and he goes with a first pitch changeup once again. Please, man, don't test me like that. Now into pitch, Dellen Batances. Let's see if he can get the hold here and set it up for a roll this Chapman in the ninth inning for the save by keeping the score the same, but we do have an 0-2 count now. Going back to the filthy knuckle curve and see if we can set down Schwarber. And that's exactly what we're going to do. The second victim for Dylan Batances, Jose Bautista. Let's see if we can set him down. And that's exactly what he's doing. One, two count, two outs. Can we get the trifecta here with another strikeout? That is going to be a ground ball. Easy play for Bogarts three outs one out in the inning and you guys already know what time it is it's a roll this chapman time let's see if he can shut the door once again pick himself up another save that would be big as we go with the slider and that's not even close so let's go back to the cheese see if we can get him to be late on it once again and he is gonna foul it off so it's time for the change up the filthy changeup down in the zone. He's been swinging at pitches out of the zone all game long. Let's see if he can do it again. But he is going to watch that one go by. So let's go with the high fastball here. 2-2 two, two count. One out in the inning. And no, nobody's going to be swinging at a pitch like that. So let's throw him off. Let's go with the changeup down in the zone. See if we can send him packing. And he's hitting a ground ball. But Jackie Robinson, speedy, over to the ball. Two outs. It would be very weird for a Roldis Chapman to get a save without a single strikeout, but that's what it looks like is going to happen this time as the hero in this one, Jim Edmonds, is able to range over, make the catch, and we are going to walk away with a 5-2 victory. Jackie Robinson able to get on base and steal two bases. That is not bad at all. That is what he's known for, stealing bases. He was unable to get a hit, but you guys can see my rating is up to 16.64. Let's see what's on our board today and it looks like we're not getting any golds i would love to have that steven piscotti but we are going to get bayfront park but make sure to keep sending in those pack opening reactions guys i appreciate every single one that you do send in and i will try to get that first episode out as soon as possible but 99 overall jackie robinson let me know if you want some more gameplay of him to see if we can get a hit but that's going to be it for this video guys I want to thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a like on it if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new to my channel for more daily MLB The Show 16 Diamond Dynasty gameplays. Go follow me on Twitter, Twitch, and Instagram. The links are all in the description down below. And until next time, guys, have a good one.